delivered. Welcome to Hootie Daddy Season 1, Jacksonville, Florida Edition. I brought eight of the baddest masculine identifying women and put them in one house to see how they can cope together and especially turn up. These hoochies will be competing for a top prize, a trip for two to Jamaica, a hoochie daddy chunk chain, and of course, bragging rights for top hoochie daddy of the house. They will be enduring competitions, staying with each other, and trying to get along in one house. I'm ready to see how this going to turn out. I don't need to say no more. Let's meet the cast to season one, hoochie daddies. Yeah, 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 it's the hoochie daddy of all hoochie daddies. I am Baltimore bastard, the realest dyke, all around entertainer, entrepreneur, rap artists of the world. People also know me as Dyke God, uh, Dyke on pole, big dyke. Whether it's my merch, my graphic designs, my sneaker, my erotic shows, all my music, I represent the mass, woman, dom, the AG, the dyke, the beautiful balance of masculinity and femininity within us is gender women. I'm from Baltimore City in the state of Maryland, known for the crab in the bucket mentality. I grew up over east in a subsidized apartment called Great Courts, where my love for music and dance grew and later became a passion. I always felt like my purpose is to spread my thoughts on life in a large platform in a relatable, so, unique way. Good. This country is fuck up this bitch. It's stupid country. All I see is dirt, trees, and bugs. I see every bug. Every time I move, I can see that thing. I mean, my book review is off the chart. I see every single insect moving. I'm, I, I don't know how I'm gonna do this. I don't know how I'm gonna do this. That guy, yeah. I just got one question. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm feeling ready. All right. Next, who's your daddy? What's up, babies? I go by the name Fantasy the Artist. Exotic entertainer, model, actress, host, music artist, and graphic designer. I'm Baltimore bred, but I'm Virginia fed. I'm coming in this house with an open mind, an open heart, and ready for whatever comes my way. I'm gonna show these other hoochie daddies that not all good guys finish last. So I hope they're ready for some good, clean competition and a whole motherfucking vibe. Let's do yes. this. What's up, Are you ready for hoochie daddy season one? Absolutely. Let's, Let's get, get it. it. shit was nothing like that. It looked like Blair Witch Project at first, but like, 
being here now, like, it's, it's lit as fuck. Like, the whole house lit, lit, all the way. What's up, everybody? It's your girl, Maya B. Music. Please don't forget the music, baby. I'm from Dooley County, Georgia, currently living in Atlanta, Georgia. I'm a soul and gospel singer that wants to expand it to film and other entertainment. I'm also a nurse. My tactic coming into the house is to play it low key and observe. I wanna check out people's strengths and weaknesses and make the best out of it. I didn't come in a fight. I'm somewhat of a peacekeeper, but I stand for truth. Coming on this show is standing in my truth. I believe that God can shine his light anywhere and through anyone, especially LGBTQ people. I hope he uses me on this show in one way or the other. One of the hardest things that I have to deal with in my life is not feeling accepted because of my sexuality. Most of all, baby, I'm here to win Top Hoochie Daddy. Maya B. Yes. You ready for Hoochie Daddy season one? Let's do it, baby. Let's get it. Let's get it. Next Hoochie Daddy, please. What's going on, everybody? It's the one and only, youngest in charge, all the way from Washington, D.C., the one they call Taz. Ladies, gents, LGBTQ, whoever watching, I'm on the Hoochie Daddy series season one, and it's going to be on Amazon Prime, and guess the fuck what? I'm here already. It's fucking bugs out here, though. I ain't with the bugs, but I'm definitely on this bitch to show y'all that I got what it takes to be a part of the motherfucking Hoochie Daddy season one. And my vibe, my energy, you know, I'm going to bring exactly what I've been bringing, me. That's it, that's all. Taz, young is in charge. What's up, what's up? You ready? I'm ready. Let's oh, get it. Ready, stay ready. Next, who's your daddy, please? What's happening, what's happening, man? I'm Moyo the General, AKA Mo Yeezy. I'm 37 years young. Yeah, 37. I know I look good. Born and raised in Fair Louisiana, fucking town. What's happening? But I live in Dallas, Texas, the big triple D. Triple motherfucking D, stand up. I am the owner of Flyer Company, part owner of Stay Down Clothing, and a promoter with Stay Down Promotion. I'm just a creative being doing fly shit. I don't really know what to expect in the house. I'ma just be me, big general. Everybody else really think I'm a hoochie daddy, so why not be one? Let's get it. What's happening? What's, what's, what's up good? with it? What's good? Moyo. What's happening? I just got one question. What's up with it? Are you ready for season one Hoochie Daddies? Don't play with it, man. I'm always ready, baby. Let's get it. We ain't finna play with it. Let's nah, get it. For sure. Next Hoochie Daddy, please. This is it, driver. This is it. This is it. Hey, yo, what's up with it? This My name's Jay Cash. Yeah. I'm from Louisiana, but I live in Dallas, Texas right yeah. now. I'm 34. Garbage. I'm a jack of all trades, so I can't really be specific mm -hmm. on everything that I do because I do every damn thing. Um, shit, coming into this house, we kind of expect everybody to kind of be on some chill shit. Kind of already been scoping the sand. They went through these niggas' profiles. I ain't gonna even lie. And they kind of seem like a vibe, so as long as they got a sense of humor and they ready to be lit, it's up. You know what I'm saying? Uh, some of my pet peeves, really, I don't have many, but one of them being is a motherfucker that don't clean up after themselves. I hate a nasty motherfucker. Like, do what you do with your area, but when you in like common areas or areas that people are commonly in, for those that don't understand. You know what I'm saying? Clean up after your goddamn self. I see you already ready. J Cash? Good. How you doing? Cool, how you living? I'm doing good. Good, good. That's a deal. Are you ready for season one of Hoochie Daddies? Oh, for sure. I'm ready for my chain. I'm ready for my trip. You hear me? Okay, then I heard that. Big heard. Big heard. Next, who's your daddy, please? What's good, y'all? Y'all already know who it is. The one and only motherfucking stud king all the way from Chattanooga, Tennessee. I'm a stud entertainer slash barber. Came down here to show y'all who the top motherfucking dog is and to bring home that gold chain and that grand prize, you heard? And also to show y'all who the real hoochie daddy is. I'm real chill, laid back. I stay in the cut and stay ready. So we about to see what this is going to be. Let's get it. How you doing? 
Good, how you doing? I'm doing good. I'm straight. Last but not least, Stud King. Are you ready for this competition? I like competing to a certain extent. And you know, I like competing when it's when it's fun. You know, I don't like competing when it leads to, you know, all the extra stuff, all the violence and unnecessary stuff, unnecessary drama and all that. So, um, I definitely don't mind competing at all. So, for the show, the show. Let's show y'all what I'm working with real quick. Y'all, it's eighty y'all in this competition. I got you guys this house. You guys will be competing for a trip for two to Jamaica. The Hoochie Daddy Chomp Chain, and of course, Hoochie Daddy Top Bragging Rights. How everybody fly in? Damn cool. 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 Y'all like the crib? Yeah, it's it's nice. Nice. It's I'm glad y'all like it. There's more than enough rooms in here for everybody, and y'all already got y'all rooms assigned. I want y'all to go check the house out, take a look, and see what it do. See how y'all like it shit, and get settled in your rooms. Be ready, because we got a challenge coming up, our first challenge. Today? Today. She definitely had a dope swag, so I didn't mind being in the back with somebody that got swag, you know, with your girl. So uh, I was a little confused on how I got a twin size bed, though. But you know, it's cool. <laughs> it's cool. I deal with it. I take it. Oh, they do what time it was. They blessed me. Time. Don't get some charge. Already what time it was. I'm like a, a low key flashy nigga, and I could tell that my roommate was on the same speed. So, see, really, we kind of like clicked right there off the swag shit, so it's cool. I was tripping. What happened? Ain't no shit fucked up? Yeah! Hey, who it is? I'm in a closet. I'm in a closet. I feel like I'm in jail. Like, it's definitely in jail. It's a whole shelf in that bitch. Like, that's where I'm putting my clothes at. <laughs> I'm putting my clothes on the shelf. Hang them up. Uh, it's a cot. A whole cot. Like, and it's breaking apart at that. And I just got here. And it's breaking apart. What everybody else talking about? What everybody else talking about? Can't go with this oh. motherfucker. They got my shit. But y'all know what? I, I'm just happy to be in the house. Okay, yeah, we'll be all right. You say something. It'll be all right. They got me on the air mattress, bro. You got an air mattress. I got an air mattress, but you know, it's going to be all right. I'm going to enjoy myself. Hey, this nigga 
over there chilling. Yeah. You, good, huh? you straight? You good? Move that nigga shit out. Yeah. I bet. Right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you got the king. Is this a hair mattress? No, that's Motherfucker, like I seen the master bedroom first, and I was like, okay, then she. I, I wonder where my room at. And I go to the back and I find my room. It wasn't too bad. I ain't gonna lie, I ain't tripping. It wasn't no twin size. It wasn't no blow up mattress. So I'm a hood nigga, man. I'm from the hood, man. I don't really give a fuck. Even though I wanted to be a mansion, I ain't tripping. Fuck it. You know what I'm saying? This is a queen bed. It'll do. I can fit me some holes in this bed. You know what I'm saying? I ain't tripping at all for sure. You can almost do a car. Yeah. 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 All yeah. that time to yeah. get out the club and now we're back in the club. Too many females and spaghetti. That's a, that's a, uh, that's a, uh, that's cool. man, fuck that's all that's though, man. I'm trying to eat, smoke, lunch. Hey, you gonna, you gonna do all right, we going out? We about to go out? What we doing? I don't know. Who said we gotta get ready for the competition? We gotta get ready. What's the fuck competition? We gotta find that out. That we gotta find that out. Touch yourself up. Okay. Hey, 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 I can get jiggy with it. Let me show y'all ain't coming. Here you go. Let me back on. You got a little ass butt. I don't give a fuck. As long as I can wrench around and wrench it off. Alright. 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 Homemade it is what it is. I don't know that guy like that. Never met her before. This is the first time. Me well, actually, I met her one time before. Back, um, I'm going to say back at a show that I did. She came through. She showed love. You know what I'm saying? Supported the show, but... You know, I don't know her like that. I'ma see how this goes when it comes to, you know, us us roommating. She in the closet though, so you know. <laughs> I got a roommate that I might not have to see. She could close her doors, so Extension cords and that bitch. I ain't even gonna hold you. Listen, we might be the only ones with our own privacy. I ain't even gonna hold you. This is the biggest hell. I ain't trying to do this. Big you got, listen, you got all this stuff in the space to put all your stuff in here. We got this whole other side over here. You know what I'm saying? So, you got some space. And you think about it, all them niggas in twin beds. 
and they ain't got no it's damn. It's a fucking twin. Yeah. Fucking you, you, you do got a twin, you feel me? But you got your own space. You got your own space. Some Everybody ain't got their own space. When they go in their motherfucking shit, they gotta look at each other. We ain't gotta do that. You got your space, I got my motherfucking That's space. the only thing about this shit. They gotta fucking do it. Yup, yeah, there we go. And our bathroom big as hell. You know what I mean? Oh, man. Say, where you from, nigga? I'm risen Baltimore, but I'm in VA right now. Oh, yeah, I'm born in Virginia. Okay, for real? Hey. What part? Uh, of course, new. Ah, that's my stomping ground. Yes, yeah, yeah, sir. Here. Where you at now? Yeah. Okay. So, you was in the Navy? No. My daddy did. Oh, uh, <laughs> I went. Okay, so you military yeah. brat. Yes, yeah, so I've been around everywhere. Oh, I feel you. Yeah. Hey, yo, uh, nigga, what made you want to do this shit? Shit, man, I'm trying to be outside. It's been a long time. I've been outside for real. I was hemmed up for a while, yeah. but oh, I'm outside now. Like out there, ain't trying to come the fuck back. You got a girlfriend? No, that's why you outside. That's when I'm outside. <laughs> yeah. I be I be trying to look dress a little bit, you know. You dripped out. You, you hear me? That ain't ready for what? <laughs> that ain't ready for this shit. Though. I swear to God, especially this flash right here. I'm telling you, I'm gonna step every time. Hey, these competitions though, I wonder what that's gonna be about. I wonder too. I'm curious. I heard. I think I heard a bitch me wrong. Somebody like switch or some shit. I'm like. A switch? I don't know. I heard, I overheard y'all. It hurts me. Okay. But yeah, I'm gonna see what this song because I already got something. If, if, if what I think it is, I'm gonna look What kind of switch? I don't no. know. I don't no. know. I, I just don't overheard that shit. Being be nosy and shit. Being nosy and shit. But yeah, yeah. I've been, I've been, I've been trying to see what's up. That's what's up. <laughs> but look, I'm cool. Look, real quick. I don't be tripping about shit, but I be cleaning up a lot. So. If you got something you don't want to touch, just put it on your side. Cause I literally come down and wipe all the services down. I own a house cleaning business, so see, I just naturally just clean up type shit. It's all respect, my guy. All right, that's all. So if I move it or I move out the way, I probably gonna put that shit up. But I just, I'm just a clean person or whatever. And you feel me? Type yeah. shit. I don't hold any other holes like that. Cause that's what I was gonna say. At least he ain't got to worry about that shit. Boy, look, look say. He having stuff all over the place and then. Uh, I don't know. Shit, I ain't gonna lie, I'm straight on this. I'm trying to see what's going on. I know, I know, I'm man. I'm good, you feel me? Yeah, for sure, for sure. For sure. Get all this shit unpacked and shit. I'm trying to see what's happening. What Jacksonville look like? That's hey. what I'm trying to see. Hoochie Dad is in Jacksonville. Hey, Hoochie Dad is in Jacksonville, baby. We got, a, uh, we got a show coming up and shit, too. So oh, for real? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah, yeah. It's some dancers or something on the yeah. cast or something like that. Yeah, hey, yeah. okay, cool. So cool, cool, cool. I know they're gonna bring the hoes. Oh, you already know. No, I'm not Yeah. But 
Uh, we gonna make do with it. That's how it is. That's how it is. We gonna make do. In the show business, they say there's so much so wrong, and we wasn't gonna let one bad stop us. All right, I got you. Appreciate that. And you're here for the competition. And make good luck to you. All right. So how many of y'all have a TikTok? Oh yeah. I barely got that. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Barely got one. You don't ready to fuck with it? Huh? You don't ready to fuck with TikTok? Not for real, but I will fuck with it. Really? And you might want to because our first challenge is the TikTok challenge. Oh. 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 Okay, so you want to get all the points by the last episode to win this whole competition. Mm -hmm. Now this challenge right here will be worth five points. And it is the only challenge that lasts the whole season. What you guys must do is make a video no least than 15 seconds long to the theme song of our show and post it on TikTok. The person with the most views at the end of this season gets five points. To the competition. Mm -hmm. Are there any questions? Nope. Mm -hmm. You have one hour. Yeah, somebody got to show you that. You have one hour. Yep. And I your time that. starts now. Good luck. <laughs> uh, damn. TikTok, though. It's like a beating, uh, if it's like a, a friendly, fair competition, you don't even necessarily got to be friendly, just as long as it's fair. I've competed against some of oppositions and, you know, they've won fair and square and likewise. So, yeah, I'm with that. So, I'm down with that. <laughs> TikTok, you don't stop. Theme song, right? That's correct. The theme song. Hold up, man. How, how this shit off, man? Who's your daddy? You're all the way live. Who's your daddy? Come outside. <laughs> <laughs> oh. 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 I don't even know how to do that shit. <laughs> oh, I almost see you in the house. Hey, man, somebody show my dude this shit, fool. Nah, I don't even know how to do that. Hey, who the fuck are you? Can everybody show my dude this? Hey, who are you? I asked one of these motherfuckers if you want to talk. Nah, can you be on that shit? Hell yeah. Oh, God. I don't even know what the fuck I'm doing. I just can't walk this shit over here. Yeah, I'm not even know. 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 i Raw raw type person, you know. If it if it go there, then it go there. But I'm not no raw raw type person. I love competition. I'm the first one ready. I'm always ready. I'm going to be ready to win. I'm going to win. Even if I don't win, I won because I've kept the same winning attitude the whole time. So I feel that inside me. I'm, I'm a winner. So I love competition. <laughs> The song called Who's Your Daddy, but by who? One. One piece of wood. One piece of wood. 
<laughs> man, I'm a I'm a laid back type of guy, man. I just be chilling, man. I just go with the energy, with the flow, man. And then that nigga video, we go to Competing, yeah, I can say I, I definitely, I definitely, definitely love to compete. I mean, it's all in, it's all in good fun, actually, but. I don't, I don't never take it too serious. I don't never take it too serious, but I'ma definitely have a fucking ball when I do it. Definitely have a ball. <laughs>
you say you know what shit? Nigga, it's a Wait a minute, though. Wait a minute, though. What you mean? Who the fuck I'm talking to? Yeah, who was you talking to? I'm talking to you. Right off the rip, like I felt a little like somebody had a chip on their show, like some bad energy walked into the house. They actually fucking TikTok. You kidding me? I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck about no TikTok. Follow the leader. I don't give a fuck about no TikTok. Follow the leader. It's fucking TikTok. Yeah, all right. Y'all niggas already know what TikTok is. This nigga talking about she's still on the first night. It's the same. It's the first night. How many of y'all was on that TikTok doing this shit? What doing what? The hand shit. When nobody doing that? I just walked through this old house when nobody doing that shit. Nigga, I'm trying to figure this shit out. How you know she real shit? That's what this told me she did. And then I came in the room. I'm like, oh, bitch, you ain't nobody about to send nobody moves. I came in the room. Out of here! 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 Out of here!